Modern Warfare Season 2 has great pipeline of content. Surprises to come. <laughs> I guess we need to talk about this in the comment section, right? Yo, this your boy Jive Turkey live from the 2 1 Mother fucking five what up i said what up what up what's what going up? on y'all chilling 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 as you can see i'm playing some call of duty modern warfare hd D. D. and that little route that that guy took the first route was pretty good. Oh, oh my! Look at look at the three D. Look! Oh, 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 oh! But that route, that four wheeler route that that guy just took, was pretty good. And what kind of karma? I forgot that happened. But the topic of the day, right? Let it sink in. Is Modern Warfare Season 2 has great pipeline content. Great pipeline of content and surprises to come, right? <laughs> so they say this on Charlie Intel. Uh, CharlieIntel.com. Just go to the Modern Warfare section. Uh... So they say that, and they give us nothing, nothing, nothing. They just, they don't nothing. tell us what it is. They just say, great pipeline of content, right? And as I click here, it's some leaked content in another, in a newer article. So it's, ah, damn. Yo, they destroyed me this game. I just, I, I looked up. I didn't even see what was going on. When I looked up, I was getting body slammed on my head. I like the finishing moves. I really like those. I really like those. I really like those. I really like those. Really like those. All right. Uh, first, really like details on Modern Warfare 2 leaked. Season 2. Not Modern Warfare 2. First, details on Modern Warfare Season 2 leaked. All right, and they have a, a MP5-ish looking gun. It's called the Striker 45 and another one called the Gr damn Growl. It's a 556 five, weapon. So I'm guessing the Striker 45 is nothing but the ump. It looks like the ump. Just from, you know, just from looking at it real quick. So they got two new weapons. Um are these weapons going to be our weapons, though? Do we have to buy these weapons? Those are the big questions because it's not the type of content that I'm looking forward to if you have to buy it. That's just downloadable content that you have to pay for. 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 I'm not buying anything from these guys. Like nothing added. Like until they show us, and and I did I, I didn't buy anything since Pepperoni Piazza in Modern Warfare Three. And yeah, I I always I always do this. I'm lying because I bought DLC on Black Ops Two. So I bought Black Ops Two DLC since Black Ops Two. I haven't bought DLC in uh in Call of Duty. And I think that was the best Call of Duty. So, you know, that justifies that. Until they can show me that they can make a good game. Like, this has all of the symptoms of a good game. Like, you know how you can have a fever? You know, you got the fever. You got the symptoms of a flu. You know, you're weak and hot. It got the symptoms of a flu, but it isn't a it isn't quite a flu. It's just a little fever, you know. 
Like you meet a chick, she got a fat ass, she got the symptoms of a bad bitch. But she's not quite a bad bitch. She just got a fat ass. You know what I mean? Look, y'all at home like, what the, uh, what the hell is he talking about? What's a bad bitch? Ugly as shit. But like I said, um, those two guns, right? They have a new operator named Ghost. Guy with a skull mask. Uh, weapon blueprints. New operator skins, so I guess it's the same operators, but they got like different outfits on. I like the operators, you know, but I just rather just remember when Call of Duty had, if you have a SMG, you have a SMG guy, you have an assault rifle, so assault rifle guy. You have a sniper rifle. It's a sniper rifle guy. That's how I used to know what kind. I used to be so methodical in Call of Duty. Like, that's how I used to know what kind of approach I take to the gunfight. Like, if I see a SMG guy, I'm not, I'm not running up on him. I'm going to shoot him from long range. If I see a sniper rifle guy, I'm running at him and jumping to the left. And, you know, like, it, it, it changed my approach to the gunfight but now it's just random the only thing that used to excuse my language fuck me up was overkill <laughs> remember overkill it will be the character like say i pick a sniper rifle and then overkill it with a shotgun or a, or an assault rifle I'll be the sniper rifle character. See, I, I made a commentary to make Overkill a different character. Also, I'm pointing to my temple like that guy, uh, like that meme. Like I, I always, I, uh, I think I'm a smart guy when it comes to Call of Duty. But like, yeah, that's the um, the update. I think this is a video. Hold on, I'm about to pause this and then watch the video, then I'll be right back. It's a video about season two. I'll be right back. So it was the season two hero video. At first, when they, they run and turn the corner, it looked like Hard Hat from Modern Warfare 3. I'm like, oh shit, they remade Hard Hat. And then I saw them on the four wheelers. And then that uh, just debunked that thought because that's not a four-wheeler map i i'm guessing that's a um what's the name ground war i'm guessing that's a ground war map so i just hope you know like i just hope for like four new maps and i'm talking about two for 6v6 and two for 10v10 ground war it, it looks so fun when I just when I watch Nate Gibson and Aimbot play it. You know, Syrian only plays like uh, you know, the the twenty four seven the little maps. But like I watch Nate Gibson and the dude Calvin play Ground War, and it looks fun. It looks fun. They got their little teammates and shit playing with them, and my teammates don't like Ground War, and I I. I thought it was all right when I played it. I guess my next video, I'll, I'll play some, show you guys some ground war gameplay. It was okay. I did pretty good, but you know, I just got to get consistent at it. Like I was saying though, um, I just want 10 v 10 maps. It's literally four. It's, I think it's like four 10 v 10 maps. It's this, it's Arcloft peak. It's, um, Grasna Raid. It might be three. Oh, and the bridge. It's four maps. It needs more than four maps. Those other two 10v, Gunrunner and Ramaza, aren't 10v10 maps. They are 6v6 maps where they just was like, put 10v10 on there. Like, like just dumb, dumbass decisions. They, they run terrible 10v10. I mean, it's people just everywhere, just for randomly for no reason. But remember, 
Kobe Bryant is the jive turkey of basketball. I'm out. And, and like the video, guys. Um, leave a comment. Tell me what you're expecting for season two. Uh, I, I just hope they get rid of skill-based matchmaking and boom, you're dead. If, if they just say we're not adding anything, we're just getting rid of skill-based matchmaking and boom, you're dead. I'm in. I'm out. I'm in. I'm out. <laughs> Ugly as shit. <laughs> Did you watch Jive's older videos? And is you following Jive on Twitter? You better. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Jive. J to the IV. The crossover slow sing them like the Osleys. And yes, even back then you can find me on the blacktop crossover 3-0.